hey guys so let me tell you something i never really thought there was much into camping except just a bunch of people wanting to act homeless and just sleeping in the middle of nowhere for no particular reason until i tried it for the first time and i could kick myself because wow my experience was out of this world and i am here to tell you all about my first ever camping experience guys so here I am, Shem Village girl. I'm packing, I'm busy trying to be nice and whatnot. And they drive because I'm like from Le Palale and I'm going to Harte Beers. So it's quite a drive. It's quite a drive and that dry area and you know, driving alone and stuff. But hey, we move. Yeah, hamburger, my kilometers. Is my kilometer girl? I bo. Yo, I so now I see that I'm almost there. It's promising now, you know, when I see that I'm reaching breaths, I'm like, okay, we're almost there now. We're almost there. And I'm just like, yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready to just be homeless in a tent. Nje. Hi, the drive has been nice. But at long, 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 long last, I am finally here by the campsite. And I will tell you this, uh, the atmosphere, Nje, on its own, when I entered there, I was like, yo, 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 yo. It's going to be happening. And the first thing that came to my mind was, where are my people, like my squad? I wish my entire squad was here because, wow, this was going to be lit. But I was here with my cousin, although I had to get here and wait for my cousin. And I'm here looking homeless and uh, confused and just lost in she. You know, but it was so nice. I got there. It was sunset and the works. You see that? That's my camping site there, right there con adventures and when i got there i got welcomed by the team from con adventures and it was just nice like look at that guys that was like imagine having something like that and it's your first experience you are bound to just be excited you know and you can tell just by looking at the site that this is actually a camping site and this is my zozo guys my zozo for the whole weekend like listen i'm literally just sleeping right. outside i get how better we came for swallow ship okay. me and my cousin there she is we just never disappointed. We were doing the swallow shipping like nobody's business. I don't even know what to eat, guys. Like, see my life. See my life. Eh? So now immediately after the swallow shipping, now we must do the games, guys. I was like, okay, what is this? Are we building a team? What team is this? Is this our, you know, work colleagues? What? What are we doing? But you know what? I just like, you know what? Let me just give it a chance. Let me just see what's going on here. And I loved and I enjoyed the team building games that we played there because wow i think i was just like Gee, these are my people that i i had never met before and i was just meeting for the first time and i enjoyed everything about meeting them and then there's this other game guys ha ah, this one where this guy the champ had to find me with a blindfold on and i was sitting on a chair there and he had to feed me a banana i kaloko guys i had to bring my gag game out on point because i was gonna choke on that thing and it was gonna kill me if i didn't bring my skills but look at me eating like that banana like a pro i i i i eat like it and he was so encouraging me this guy <laughs> it's like yeah eat it eat it, eat it. I, I will I will eat and guess who won of course of course the banana eaters the banana eaters will explain. thank you very much and just like that the champs are back we're about to go do the serious stuff now which is the um, river rifting and look at that guys like look at our camping site it was so beautiful my gosh and the weather was just weathering what's look at that that is amazing <laughs> We are hoping to find a vuru vuru <laughs> of man. <laughs> some anaconda, yeah, and some anaconda, anaconda in the water. Yeah. Okay, now we're off to the river. The shock of my life, guys. I underestimated what was about to go down in the river. It took me days to recover from what happened in the river. It took us seven hours, if not more or less, to actually get the whole trip in do the whole trip river rifting guys it was yo it was it was a like i don't even know how to explain that experience and when we started off here you know even the river looks scary you know you would think yo i'm gonna perish in this river until you get in there and literally you can see that listen if i do not what do you call this if i don't pedal this thing i'm gonna perish in the water 
you know the story about the guy that i was paired with it's a story for another day but yeah i thank god i made it alive and i was able to walk after this because wow 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 my feet were like listen and just like that guys that was my nice experience